Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in. In today's video, we are going to talk about how to embed Medium blogs into your website using Sociable Kit and the Website Builder WordPress. So for today, we are going to use our Sociable Kit Medium blogs account. And this is our blogs. You can guys check it out. And we are going to use this. So without further ado, let's get straight back to the video. So first things first, we are going to uh, go to the official website of Sociable Kit, which is sociablekit.com. And here it is. So from here, you can guys create uh, your account. So if you haven't created your account yet, you can click this sign up button at the top right of your screen. And if you click this, it will automatically redirect you back or redirect you to the sign up page. So in our case, I have already uh, created my account. And so we are going to choose this login button. And from here, this is the widget page. So if you have already created a widget before, it will redirect you always in this page if you have already created some widgets. So to go to the creation of widget page in the top right of your screen, click this create widget button. And if we click this, it will redirect us to the creation of widget page. And here it is. So from here, we are going to select our widget type. So in our case, it's medium blog. So here it is. And from here, it, re it requires us to put our medium ID. So what is our medium ID? So going to our medium account, the medium ID is basically this. So all we have to do is copy this and go back to the official page and paste it here. And we're going to click next. And from here it says this uh, medium blog or our widget or feed is syncing in. So it might it might take up to 12 hours depending on the data or the content of your uh, social media and it, and it will the social book it will always send you an email if the widget is already synced in and uh, from uh, all we have to do now is you know click understand and wait and if you think there is a problem yeah, yeah you can always click this chat with support here and you can talk to our uh, customer service team and that is all I will catch you guys uh, I will return back if the medium blog is synced in and we are back so here is our medium blog so everything is in here every single blog that is in here you can guys check if you guys want so everything is in here and I will show you guys to the uh, left side of our screen this is the customization and moderation tab so I'm going to explain it to you guys one by one so first this is the basic tab so you can rename your widget so for example you want to get back to this widget later so you want to name it example SK blogs so if I come back I can always see the uh, widget that I'm working with. So this is the SK blogs, and next is the domain. So you, I can change the URL of our website. So for example, I want it to be SK Medium Medium Blogs .com. So that is my URL. So I'm going to save change it, and next we are going to the themes tab. So in here. You can change the color of your theme so it's based on this different kinds of theme so every theme has its own different kinds of color scheme so for example this maganda theme if I click this all of these colors will apply to the widget or to the feed so you can choose whatever themes that you like that fits your um, company or your website so in our in my case, I think this one is a lot more simpler and more professional. I think 
that's my own opinion and I think I like this Maliwala stem here it's very basic but it's I think it's more fitting for the sociable kit website so next in the profiles tab these are the different kinds of check boxes that if you want to show the publication name or not same with the star with by text in the profile desc description so like this so it's up to you guys I think I want it to keep it that way and next the post tab I can choose the layout of my um, I can choose the layout of my feed so for example I want it to be carousel and th then this will change it to a carousel layout so if I click save changes it should change going to wait and here we go successfully saved and here is now our carousel layout and I think that is good so next we can change also change the post height the column count the spaces between the posts and we can uh, sort it by the most recent or the oldest so it's up to you guys I'm going to keep it that way and next is the post item so same like in the uh, profile it also has different kinds of check boxes with different kinds of purposes so it can show your post title your author name the post date the post description and the more button and now we go to the carousel so this carousel tab is only exclusive if you choose the carousel layout so depending on what layout you choose this can also change so in our case we have carousel so I can change the color of the arrow here's the arrow I can also change the color of the hover hover or hover in the arrow opacity so I can also choose to auto play it and the delay of the sweep or the sweep or the swipe of the carousel so now in the moderation tab I can approve post if I want to and in the pop-up tab I can uh, change the color of the pop-up uh, background or in the font and the link so the pop-up is this so I can change the color of the background I can change the color of the font and so on so for uh, now we're going to the colors tab so if you didn't find the color theme that you like in the themes tab you can always manually change it in the profile background color so you can change the uh, uh, profile background color font color description color the post background color the font the post of the front color uh, font color and so on so you can uh, find the best color scheme in here if you want a combination that really fits your website or your business so next in the text uh, tab you can just change the stories by text that's all really is in the font you can always change the font so for example I want it to be um, let's see this this font so if I save changes from century gothic it should change to Arial font family and now see here it is it changed to Arial font so now to the button tab you can also change the button so here is the button you can change the color of it and the text color and so on and the CSS you can custom you can add your custom CSS here so that is all guys if you guys want to embed this now all you have to do is go to the top right of your screen and click this embed on website button so if you click this it will allow you to choose what website builder you are currently using so in our case or in this videos case is the WordPress and we're going to click it or just search it if you can find it in the display so here it is WordPress and from here it shows us the step-by-step -step process and how to embed this widget into the web uh, to our WordPress so we're just going to follow this and we're going to start so first we're going to copy the following code so we're first going to choose and I think JavaScript code is the best so we're going to copy it and now we are going to our WordPress so uh, 
we're going to add a new page so for example you have created a new page and you want this page to be your medium blog page so in here I'm going to put sociable kit medium blogs and from here we're going to click this add block and we are going to search for custom HTML so here it is and from here we are going to paste the JavaScript code and that is it so it's simple very simple very straight to the point and all you have to do now is publish it if you want to see it you can always edit it back if you want to add more so in our case we're going to publish this to publish it to show you guys our sociable kit medium blogs so here it is everything that we change the layout to carousel the font family to Arial, the color scheme and so on so everything is in here every blog from our medium blog is in here so that is all guys it's very simple uh, thank you guys for watching I hope you guys come back for more tutorials we have different kinds of tutorials for different kinds of widget and different kinds of website builder that supports sociable kit so please uh, comment down below like and subscribe always and if you are interested in using social book kit you can always check our social book kit um, different kinds of social book kit subscription plan so in here you can see our basic free plan so here is the um, basic free plan and the features the starter kit 2 the features business kit 2 and the features and the elite kit 2 and so on so everything is in here guys you can also pay annually and monthly so everything is in here guys in this pricing tab page so you can guys check it out if you're interested and thank you for listening and i'll catch you guys in the next one